I want to give a really brief introduction to Discord because for beginners and maybe some people that aren't real tech aficionados, uh, Discord can be a little bit uh, overwhelming at the beginning, but it's a great application for chat and for meeting with groups and clubs. And it's definitely something that uh, you should take a look at in all the other social media that you might have. So let's get into it. Um, I want to start by first just talking about what Discord is. It's a chat application. You can download it. It also has an app on your phone so you can set notifications. Um, but it's not like your typical uh, social media like Snapchat or Facebook in that Discord is really self-contained. It's more of uh, just chat versus social media. And let's just first when we join and you get a server or you join a server, uh, you'll have several parts, okay? So first you have all the servers that you're part of. Here are all the servers I'm part of. I'm part of like 24 right now, that's kind of crazy. Uh, we have our categories and channels, which are listed over here. You have your chat stream, uh, which is in the middle. And you have all the members and their associated roles on the side. And part of getting used to Discord is a lot of that terminology. So that terminology, um, I'm gonna be going over in this video, just so you're familiar with it, because that terminology can often be that thing that you know, kind of gets us hung up on as we not familiar with that. So one of the things you can do to join a server is you find one, you can just Google it. You know, Discord server for name your interest. And whatever interest you have, there's probably a Discord for that, um, especially when it comes to gaming, because Discord is made uh, used mainly for uh, gaming and gamers. Um, and we can easily generate links uh, for people to join. You make your own server. You can just invite people to join your server. So that is so easy to get other people that are interested into your server, and you can start chatting right away. Um, you can also leave servers, of course, as well. Now, there's both text and voice chat in Discord. And this is one of the key ways that it's used within gaming. You have a chat where you can go in and any number of people can play a game or watch a presentation, even for business, and chat, voice chat at the same time. And each one of these usually has chats, you can have different channels, right? So these uh, are what you know we, we call these, and you can add channels. And the cool thing about the channels is you can make them role specific. So you'll find in a lot of uh, different discords that specific channels are only usable by specific people. Um, smaller discords, it's not as common, but bigger ones, um, usually there's like a channel that's just for moderators um, and it's just like moderator chat so um, you know we can go in and usually you'll see a little lock and it'll say moderator chat on it so you have to have that role as a moderator to use that channel and chat on it so it's kind of nice to be able to have that customization within a chat where you can exclude some people and include others based on roles all right so uh, when we look at different channels, you know, explore new channels and see what it has as far as options for channels and who can join it and who can in certain chats. And a lot of times it's specific for that, you know, game or that interest of that person. Now, roles are something that um, are unique to these uh, Discord servers. Uh, this is you know, my server here, one of the servers I, I run, and you can make as many roles as you want. For this, I made a, a role for like subs in my channel, VIPs. I made one that just says elite. Um, and these roles, you can make additional ones with additional colors and you can assign people those roles. You can also go in and when you have a server, uh, let me find one here, uh, you can have people have to choose a role. And usually you'll see on there, uh, there'll be something about role selection, right? And often you have to click an icon or you have to type something into the chat that'll enable you to then join that. That's something that I didn't know right away with Discord, that you know that's how roles work. 
Um, but that it's very common that in a lot of channels you get those specific roles. And sometimes you can have more than one role. No, often you do. Um, it's sometimes you're limited to roles as well, especially when we talk about moderators um, and admin on channels. So that is a brief overview of the layout of Discord, what it's for, and some features that you may not have been familiar with. Uh, one last thing uh, before we go, and that is be aware that for Discord, you do you should be 13 year olds or or older to use uh, Discord. Uh, that's something that you're going to need uh, to know, especially if you're a teacher, you're working with kids, um, and if you're you know a teacher or other you know adult uh, working that, uh, and you're trying to get people involved, not everyone uses Discord or is even familiar with it. So you know this kind of video and other. Uh, resources can be shared with them so they're kind of aware of what discord is all about and my suggestion is you know start a server you know play around with it easy enough right you you get discord down here at the bottom you just click add a server click create server you can have it named whatever and create it right and you're already set up and you're going to invite people if you know anybody right and otherwise you can just share it out and get people on there share it on your social media be like hey i got a something i want to you know share out with everyone please join we're going to talk about whatever this is a discord about this topic right and you can easily just start adding channels all right maybe this is about birds or something right create channel okay done um you can do you can add voice channels you can move things around so very customizable very easy uh, to do. I hope you enjoy using Discord. There is so much more to it than I covered in this video, but thanks for watching.